All right, so that little PC I built for myself, I got it mounted in my rack. I barely have enough room. This is a little Tenu uh, previously wall-mounted rack that I repurposed. I used to have all this stuff on my desk, well, along with my desktop. <laughs> but um, this little rack is, uh, has been fantastic. Cleaned up my desk, I got everything nice and organized in one spot. And uh, yeah, I love it. I will uh, show the back side here now. Here's the back side. I haven't got the cables all hooked up yet. I have a bunch of cable mess. I gotta figure out some stuff I can eliminate, but there's just barely enough room for this receiver to breathe once everything's all said and done. I have a feeling I might want to put a fan on there, rig something up, just to kind of be nice to it, keep it a little cooler. It's always been kind of warm, but previously I had a uh, open panel, one you have open space above the receiver, so that that kind of got taken away since I filled up the rack. This isn't mounted the best, but luckily it's uh, resting on the bottom lip of the rack. I would have put it up higher, but there's nothing to support this back end and I didn't want it resting on other stuff. Also, I kind of had to rearrange everything since I tried putting the receiver up top and it's like, yeah, it's not going to get any room to breathe. So, in the next clip, I'll show everything hooked up. Well, I got the back wired up, I think. I can't think of anything else I need to hook up. It's definitely a party in the back. Unfortunately, it's probably going to be a party in the front as well. I don't know what I'm going to do. There's not really any good way to cable manage this with as much stuff as I have in there. Also, some of these cables are too short, even if I wanted to manage them. I'm going to have to be careful when I pull this out in the future. But... Yeah, hopefully it'll work. One thing I need to do is I think I'm going to rig up a 120 millimeter PC fan on top of the receiver just to suck all the hot air out of it. And then I'll uh, rig up a power supply off one of these outlets. But yeah, uh, next clip will be the front once I'm done wiring that up the rest of the way. All right, well, this is the final setup for the most part. I have to do something with these two cables, and then uh, this one's just temporary. I need to pull the files off my old PC into the new one. So, yeah, it looks pretty nice. I'm pretty happy with it. Cleaned up nice. I got rid of a bunch of cables I don't need anymore since I had a lot of extra stuff. This I'm going to have to move somewhere else. That's my keyboard. If I leave that there, I know good and well it's going to get kicked eventually, and I'll bust that port. But, yeah, I'm really happy. This will be uh, quite the upgrade. I was using that Tel Precision T3500, which it's a great PC. There's no reason for me to really upgrade from it, but um, I decided I wanted to go to Windows 10, and I just figured it'd be nice to have newer hardware that was UEFI compatible. So, thanks for watching.